bashe ni wajo koni wala ni wasu thank you very much for, for that question uh, about four years ago in Oshodi Solo I contested for counselor I won Galagi but A A B A C A C A refused to give me my money Secondly, in 2011, I contested against the the incumbent chairman of that local government. In that in that December, I was chairman. The out of about uh, 40 over 552 registered voters, is only I mean uh, that election recorded 19,200. And from this 19,200, six uh, candidates contested, including NCP. With the Riggi APC got got first, PDP second, NCP got about uh, 4,800 votes. You understand? So what I'm saying is that during this election, that it was obvious the Riggi was already they are not even hiding it. It's, 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 it's not it's not hiding. Together with the police, they are they are working with the police. Immediately after the election, we we we, we went to the tribunal, but we discovered that uh, the the tribunal committee, they are. I don't want to use bias, but let me quote you. Understand? Do you understand? They are not. They are not. They are. They are not ready to to say the truth. Not only on should look at what we will be winning the other local governments. Not even only legal state. But what we are, what we are, what we are agitating is free and fair and credible election. Believe you me. If last year conduct free and fair election, we are going to win more than we see local government in Lagos State. Wow. Now, in addition to that, I also want to narrate an experience in 2008. We compelled them to conduct local government election in Lagos State in 2008. By then, I was the chairman, Lagos State chairman of NCP. And we were coasting to win in a place they call Aboyiketu. In fact, at Aboyiketu, you drop your car beside the river there, you, Keno, you enter Keno 20 naira to the other side, there are uh, reverend communities over there, and our candidates were winning the, the three words in that area. The next AC, AC under under government fund, right? Fund that they were called AC. Right? The next in the visa, ah, I will you, I will you. The local of NCP is uh, your two eyes. I will show you. I will you. We never talk about this place. They started. In fact, they said, okay, you people wait. We will talk to inside the river now. And I was the leader of the team. They were about to drop once in that river before I called the commissioner of police there, Marvel, Apoyo. And that was the day I know as inefficient as our police may be, they still have what they call marine police. Marine police, they came with speedboat from VI, from Island, towards that side. They were the ones that rescued us from the plushies of the Tinubu, Spasola, ACN, as at that time. So, so far, how will you be conducting election? In 20 constitutional local government and the so-called assembly CD, and it will always be on your own party alone that will be winning. If we look at the case of uh, the Obani Kolos or the Koyobani CD, the Prime Obani Kolos won. They reach him. You understand? And if you go to the you are talking of, you see Nigeria have a lot of problems. Until when we revolutionize the whole issue, the state governor is the one to appoint. The board of the state and independent electoral commission. He is the one to appoint the, the tribunal, the electoral tribunal. Even at national level, the president is the one to appoint the INEC to appoint the electoral tribunal. These are the crises and part of what Sarah reporter said earlier: the confusion in our constitutional provision that gave power to somebody who also have political interest in the same post you are contesting for, for him to determine who is going to be the umpire. In such a situation, you are bound to see. All this kind of apathy you are talking about. And that is why, if they have performed, my brother, 14, 15 years in governance in Lagos, if you have truly performed, yeah. local government people supposed not to be begged before they will come out to come and vote for you. Yeah. Yeah. Keep it up. Why can't you conduct election now? Tell them they are fraudsters in government. They are thieves, ambassadors of Nigeria, Tan, and some <laughs> other crises <laughs> we have in this country. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe I should also try to add. 
because uh, uh, every opposition will try to uh, reform the members of the press. NCP, your question was, why are we not winning election? It's because they told him the ground. Simplicity. And it's because the incumbents, the real political party at federal and state level and local government level, they have been amassing, looting the treasure of the, of, of, to, of the public to consolidate their whole to power. I consider it as child governor of Lagos State against what I'm in fact And that being the modest who I had to take account to the, to the debate, I was adjourned the best candidate among all the governors of Canada. Even if we look for Shola, you know, we have the pedigree, we have the antecedent, we have the material. But the only thing we don't have, which we are not part of, is tia, is looting the treasure. <laughs> That's the thing. <laughs> we have the material, we have everything. And our manifesto is the most beautiful. Yes. It was a, a manifesto that was fashioned by an enigma. And if the party gave person like Galipai, that is this flawless. And that's why we are, we are never amended that it's valid at, at, at the very two. We are not never amended. So, the point I'm trying to make is that we are at a disadvantage. And when I contest it like all NCP members, I don't buy votes. I don't even have the resources, even voting. Voters or electorates, they give us votes voluntarily. Without possessing it. Thousands of votes that I got when I got that government was I never paid a die. But me and you know that none of the ruling political parties can win election without buying votes in this country. No. APC, PDP, I stand up with challenge. They have all, all the votes that they have been getting, so called, to win election for them to rule, they've been possessing it. And that's what they are doing. They are mad, they, they do the changing. Tell me, for example. What does the senator need 30 million for monthly? That is part of the looting. Is there any civil one in Labour State that uh, millions are being spent by fashion lab for security votes? Is there a civil one here? There is, there, for, for, for nine years, for, 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 for 16 years, we are surrounded by water and because there's no water to drink. And that is immorality that they want to come back. They have the audacity to say they want to come back. I travel out of this country, I go to Geneva, I drink free water. I don't buy water. I'm not from Swiss. I say it's everywhere. They are shameless elements. So, they know. They know what NCP represents. They know what we represent. And that's why all the issue of the Russian political party, they know we are a threat to them. We are a threat. That if we get to power, we are going to revolutionize everything. And that's why it's difficult for us to match with any of these political parties. We have our brand, we have our name, we have our identity. How can I be in a party, a government that's not prepared to give free education? Fabricating with it, look at the housing, there's no water. It is, it is not enough for any, any government that is in power for 16 years. And we cannot get water in Lagos, it's condemning. <coughs> Government in power for 16 years, but I need to watch the government of Lagos for 8 years. Is it going to UK for medical treatment? It means that those hospitals are good to us for me and you. When Fajara's father was sick, he took his father out of the country. Can we afford? No. Ordinary knee injury, but I need to go, took it to UK. That child with the picture of our hospital. If it's good for Bola, Bola gets it, it's good for our people. Are you going to any public office? Government's office? Look at the channel and you see them entertaining people with poor water or pure water. It is for the of all. They drink bottled water. It is rich. I'm saying there, I've been to South Africa, the water that Mandela drank, the public tar that Mandela drank, is what Bruma is drinking. In all Rossi, Rossi of Zarulanta, Rossi of Pretoria, all cities of, of South Africa. They are all taking water from the kind of water, the same water that the president is drinking. But here there is discrimination. The only thing that are, they have got as punished them, which they cannot quarantine, which they cannot take from us, is the air we breathe. How that thing they're taking it out of the reach of the masses. I hope it will bother me too. I hope it will anybody. The same air that I breathe is. If they have the power, 
They will have to make and they will have to send the air for us. That's it, sir. That's it. They will have commercialized it. <laughs> That's it. So they are not what that of what is the pride of the government? That wants to continue for 60 years cannot give us water to get in because we are surrounded by water. It's condemnable. Now I hear that the free education in, in the South West, at minimum, people like us who have been educated, they are beneficiary. There should be no child or school fees. And that goes at the philosophy. That's what Ghani Fahim stood for. That's what the NCB stood for. If you are on the bright, not selective, not political talks, you will pay sick to survive with the call on a, on, on a public benefit. That's if it's on Nigerians are earning it abroad. They see all those goodies all over the places. So why what they do? Look at the trend now. There is no there is, there, there is no there is no serious any any deep country can have is going to send it. Any company can have is going to ask for friends. And you keep on recycling yourself. And the problem persists in Nigeria. How can you pay 27 million for nomination for? 27 million. 27 million nomination for. What is the difference between NPC and PDP? They are bears of the same feather. So, and they know that NCP constitutes a threat. And that's why they are trying to scramble it or they are trying to squeeze us by all means. They want to deregister, be to the court. Even when they are taking this decision, they dominate the National Assembly. Equity demands that if they want to take a decision on us, that we don't have a seat in that day, they, they, it, uh, 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 rule of national justice and fair hearing demand that they should invite us to that so Why are many times has I not invited so called uh, uh, smaller political parties? What is your problem? Because they know that one day we get there, we are going to we are going to rock the boat. So they prefer to keep us at bay. Those are some of the factors that are militating. Against that we don't have, you want to tell me that even if it's by promotion or gift, can you find it also decide to be the president of this program than about some job? No, it is. How can can you find me get 20 votes from the who is the who remember where his wife comes from? They were just doing out votes. If you can happen to can you find me, some of us we are still bet we are undaunted. We can't be in APC tomorrow morning and be in PDP tonight, and tomorrow morning you are in the we are principled. We are tied to our philosophy, ideology, and ideas, and the programs of this party that we cannot just so we cannot even if it's few of us that are remaining, we stand by it and we keep on saying. And this media should assist us. If we don't win an election tomorrow, we can have three or four or five years to a program to win an election, it's next to sensation. Over our political party as in the UK, who are only two or three are, 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 are on the forefront, that they never won an election, it's only years. Where are we are where we copy the presidential system. There is nothing, there is nothing in the dictionary of US democracy like party deregistration. It's an abnormality. I don't know where they got got this rubbish from. It's intimidating us and the national dynasty of the party. It doesn't even give us room to plan properly. Today they can't go to the next time you hold them. Now we are we are back to the I mean, it's not so, fear. Right. Tomorrow you are saying go to the oh we have a we have a plan. It's diversionary, it's limiting, it's harassing. We are not school children. It's not a headmaster that you see you you become harassing us. So political parties should be left to evolve and die naturally. Nigerians should decide which political party they should vote for. 